Well, Edwin's in Shaker Square is part of a well-known second chance program that offers those who've been incarcerated to learn skills in fine dining. Now the program plans to add child care services to make sure that those who are enrolled have one less reason to drop out. Brandon Simmons joins us live from Shaker Square to explain how it all works. Hi, Brandon. Yeah, hi, Betsy. Yeah, anyone with kids probably knows how hard it can be to find child care sometimes. And here at Edwin's Restaurant Institute, we know that 80% of their students would drop out of the program for that very reason. They couldn't find child care. So here's the fix. CEO and founder Brandon Krastowski and Edwin's are purchasing a property nearby that will be turned into a nearly 3,000 square foot child care center. Now the property is a short walk from here, so students wouldn't need to find transportation to go pick up their children if needed. And the best part about it, it's all going to be provided for free under the Edwin's nonprofit umbrella. Now the space will be built out to accommodate about 20 kids, but they're gonna start with just 12 but even those 12, that makes a huge difference for those who need help. You know, we have a student right now, four children. She's doing the program. It's tough finding after hour child care, child care when it's needed. It's a big, it's a big hurdle, but now we're going to start clearing that. Now, Krastowski has already raised more than $350,000 to purchase the property and get the project started. He says he knows he'll have no, no issue finding students and alumni of the program who would want to enroll. That's the easy part. Now, obviously, a lot of people want to know when is this facility going to open up. He says it doesn't take a lot of renovation to get it going. There's already a tenant in there now. He's thinking maybe late September or early October, Betsy. Brandon, this is great news for those folks. I, I just... I can't say enough about the, the good that they do and the opportunities that they give. So making one thing a little bit easier is certainly very welcome news. Thanks so much for the report. Yeah, definitely good news.